cancer often has no specific symptoms, so it is important that people limit their risk factors and undergo appropriate cancer screening. Most cancer screening is specific to certain age groups and your primary care doctor will know what screening to perform depending on your age. People with risk factors for cancer should be acutely aware of potential cancer symptoms and be evaluated by a physician if any develop. Number 1. Your back or stomach hurts. Pain in the abdomen or mid-back may be caused by a tumor. Depending on its location, the tumor may be pushing against nerves or organs near the pancreas or blocking the digestive tract. Persistent pain. Nagging back pain, a headache that would not go away, abdominal or stomach pains your doctor needs to know. No pain, no gain does not apply to cancer. And, persistent pain, no matter the location, can be the first sign that something's wrong. Number 2. You have trouble digesting food. Loss of appetite, indigestion, and nausea are common in people with pancreatic cancer. Some or all these symptoms may occur when a tumor blocks or slows the regular digestive processes. Changes in your mouth. If you smoke, chew, dip or spit tobacco, you need to pay close attention to changes inside your mouth. White patches inside your mouth or white patches on your tongue may be precancers. Left untreated, these areas can turn into oral cancer. Source, unexplained bleeding, numbness or tenderness in the area around your mouth, like your tongue, lips and cheeks, should tell you that it is time for a checkup. Number 3. Bleeding. Coughing up blood can signal lung cancer. Blood in the stool could be a sign of colon or rectal cancer. Women who experience unexplained vaginal bleeding should be checked for cervical or endometrial cancer. A bloody discharge from the nipple can signal breast cancer, while blood in the urine can mean you have bladder or kidney cancer. Unusual bleeding can occur during any phase of cancer and warrants a visit. Number 4. You are losing weight and you do not know why. Weight loss can be caused by incomplete digestion due to the cancer or by the cancer itself. Cancer-induced weight loss is a problem that affects the way the body uses calories and protein. It can cause the body to burn more calories than usual, break down muscle and decrease appetite. Number 6. Your skin and eyes look yellow. Jaundice is a yellowing of the skin and eyes caused by the buildup of bilirubin a component of bile. This buildup can happen if the tumor blocks the bile flowing from the gallbladder into the small intestine. People with jaundice may also have itchy skin, dark urine, and light or clay-colored stool. Number 7. Variation in bladder activity. Because urinary tract infections are common in women, this symptom is often disregarded as just another uti. But whether you're male or female, if you notice blood in your urine, experience sudden urgency, or feel pain while going, definitely bring it up with your doctor to rule out cancers of the bladder, kidney, number 8. Your stools are changing. Many pancreatic cancer patients have diarrhea, constipation or both. Diarrhea consisting of loose watery, oily or foul-smelling stools can be caused by insufficient amounts of pancreatic enzymes in the intestines. Constipation is also a common problem. If the digestive system works too slowly, it can cause stools to become dry, hard and difficult to pass. Number 9. A long-lasting sore throat. A sore throat may be just another winter woe but a persistent one could point to something more severe, such as laryngeal cancer or throat cancer. Of those surveyed, nearly 78% didn't think throat woes were serious, 